Hello. I apologize for how late this Q&A video is, but uh, for those of you who don't know, um, when you are a silver gold level patron, which is five or more dollars a month, uh, you are able to submit questions whoops, for my uh, monthly Q&A video uh, that's patron only. So uh, let's answer some of the questions that Scott Maloney asked me. Uh, Scott has always been a, a, an amazing supporter of mine, and I'm really grateful for him. Uh, and he gave me a lot of questions, uh, a lot of good questions, and so I'm going to do a little more, a little bit more rapid fire this time, because uh, usually people ask me only one question and I just go into detail on them. Okay, so let's get started. What's your favorite thing at Dim Sum? My absolute favorite thing at Dim Sum is the chong fin. So that would be like the the really wide, like rice noodles that um, that have like shrimp folded into them. Uh, this there's like a sweet soy sauce that always goes with it. That's it's just really really good. Uh, D and D class you most like to play. I've I haven't played it. I haven't played D and D enough, but. Um, I, my current character that I have is a warlock, a female war, warlock, and I really enjoy it. Um, I actually kill a lot of things using my Eldritch Blast, which, yeah, so it, it feels pretty good. Uh, D&D class, you, you most are IRL. Whatever is the most passive one, so probably Cleric. Um, guilty pleasure movie slash anime. Guilty pleasure slash movie slash anime. Uh, what's a guilty pleasure movie slash anime that I have? Oh, a uh, grenadier. <laughs> Uh, because there's a lot of boobs that happen, but also, like, the, the gunplay that they show on, on that anime is actually really good. Um, yeah. Gun Grenadier is, like, the anime that's notorious for, like, like, literally, the girl just, like, wiggles her chest a little bit, and then, like, bullets fly out of her boobs, because that's where she stores them, and she's able to just, like, kind of, like, click them into her gun really quickly. Yeah. Unpopular opinion you hold. Uh, the one that I can think of right now is the fact that I would like to... I think people need to migrate off of Twitter and Facebook eventually because they just keep proving that they're not really good and they're not... They're really, really not user friendly, and they are responsible for a lot of bad in the world. Uh, what's what does the moral life? Consist of? I don't know what that question is. So I'm, I can't answer it. Sorry. What? Uh, what makes you happiest? What makes me happiest is. Making my friends laugh and also, like, being able to make something that I'm really proud of with my friends. What should someone know who would want to be your friend? Hmm, that just because I care about social issues doesn't mean I always need to talk about them. And that... What's just, what's just someone, hmm. You're most likely gonna eat a lot of Japanese food with me? Yeah. And what always makes you laugh no matter what? <laughs> really, really base, dirty jokes. Like, I really enjoy immature jokes. The kind that you see on Will and Grace a lot. Um, yeah. They always get me. Yeah. 
I guess that's it. Uh, thanks so much for all of your questions, Scott. I really appreciate it. And um, uh, once again, if you're interested in asking me questions, uh, please become a patron, uh, specifically $5 or more a month. And because uh, it, uh, it really helps out the channel. And so this is kind of my way of saying thank you to people who are like monetarily supporting me because um, it's really what keeps the channel running. Uh, so that's all I have. Thanks so much for watching. I love and appreciate you very much, and I'll see you next time.